Hey everybody, Josh here, and we are joined again by Paradox Gamer. Welcome back to Thea the Awakening Multiplayer. Hello. So how are we doing so far, Paradox? We're alive, right? That's that's Still the plan. Still alive, yep. Yes. I just need to gather some wood so I can um, so I can get uh, one of the buildings going. Yeah. And that would be a cabbage field, I think. Cabbage yeah. field. Yeah. For so kids and. Kids and humans. I need 35 wood for that. Currently have 22. Of course, I got elven wood down here. I should be going crazy trying to gather that right now. I wish I had some more gathering baskets so that I could gather it a lot quicker. Um, because I would love to start getting stuff to attract elves because elves are awesome. Oh, encounter. And what is this? Uh, house collapses. Oh, is everybody? Physical. Yeah, you got, you got everybody in this village. Yeah, okay. everybody's in there, so that should be fine. Um, counter tactic seven. I don't know what the strength is. Counter offense ten. That would be that would be hilarious. Let's try that. Counter offense ten. Yeah, he's out. So you can only bring in one from the right side. And then we will just kill it off. Get closer. Killing's always good. Unless it's you or me. Preferably you to me, though. There we go. Physical challenge passed. Why do I get wounded? It says plus six. So that is uh, a wound, right? Yeah, plus six, so you healed wounds, probably. I did? Sounds like it. Oh, I attracted somebody. I attracted a warrior. No, no, I got, I got wounded from that. Seven. How much did I need for that? Cabbage. Thirty-five. Yeah. All right. So we should have two turns. Rain now. So let's pick up camp and let's just race home. I'm not gonna go fight that guy just yet. Ah, uh, hi guys. What are you? Spores? Yeah, spores. Okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to fight you. Because I, yeah, I did it the wrong. I did it the cheaty way. Well, it's not really cheaty. I, I uh, ran my full length instead of running one tile at a time when I or running to the edge of what I could see. Hmm. So, if you run to the edge of what you can see, you can uh, do a little bit better with things. Um, you know, be more efficient. Cut in and attack the proper things. You know, do all the things properly. You know, I, I don't play the game right. That, that's that's the real short end of it, is I don't play the game right. So now I'm going to have to do a fight challenge instead of... I probably could have done a hunt challenge. And that's okay. Yeah, you got five people. But yeah, it is a two how, skull. How yeah, how could it possibly this? go wrong? Uh, well, let's see if I can support, then I can kill the first guy. What can I support? No. I could first action somebody, though. Oh, you know what? I will... Pop a little um, spear dude in here, and that'll that'll do it for us. I can do another one. Who do I want to? Uh, not really. I will though. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're gonna kill him. Ten, eleven, and twelve. You kill him. So those two are dead. As long as I counter the tactics, which I can't do. Well, I'm on a roll. Let's go ahead and shield you up. And... I could get closer, but then they can attack this way. No, they're both going to be dead. Let's do this. Actually, he shouldn't ever even be in the attacks, right? Right. There we go. 
Ooh, I got an Enchanted Bone. Because one Enchanted Bone does great things for you. Let's see. Yeah, I need one more. And then I'll probably need some food after that because I'm down to... Food 11? If only we had peace. I need 25. Oh, wait, we were talking about the game, weren't we? Alright, so I did the cabbage patch, so I can do the pasture now. Let's do this thing. Let's do... If I had a little bit more granite, I could have used granite there. That would have been nice. That looks good. Wait, what are you crafting? Just gonna put you here. Not worried about that other thing yet. You guys. Yeah, maybe I can craft something. Mm, nope. No straws for gathering Absolutely. tools. So I could go straight for the smithy, but I think I really want to get gathering tool stuff first. I really need more gathering. If we had nimble wood, I would see it. So I don't see it, so we don't have it. Could save the point for now and go for a high end material. I think, though, I'm gonna start going into. You got both oh, green go... and straw. Yeah, straw's not very useful. Well, for making gathering baskets. Yeah, but it's the low level one, so. That's why, that's why I like the spider silk. But you need it, don't you? It's the primary. It's the only primary material. Well, if you look at the research screen and you look, you find where straw is. If it shows straw, then you got straw or anything above it. So you got straw, and then you've got the wicker or the bamboo no, okay. cane or the nimble wood. So it's always anything above. Oh, okay. Actually, I remember seeing some stuff down here. Uh, so let's go ahead and head that way instead. I'm just randomly walking in different directions. Oh, but I'm also out of food. So is there food down here? Ah, there'll be, there'll be food. We'll find food. Who needs food anyway? How much supply? How much fuel? Is it one per day? One per day, yes. Ah, I got a calculate this. How much do I need for a cabbage field? I need 25 food. I have 19. And I will be gathering 11. Okay, so next turn. So, food food is um, one per person per day. So, just so firewood is one, one per day um, for the expedition and one for the city, but food is one per person. So if, I, if I've calculated this right, I should be able to build it now. Hello. <sighs> so let's see, do I want him to attack me? I could use metal. Oh, I can't attack him. Does that make any difference though? Attract children one, attract human two. If I use wood, it's the same thing. Honey. For what? Uh, cabbage field. Oh. Yeah, let's just do use the wood then. Oh, you have something else you can do it with? Hmm? Yeah, metal. Yeah, yeah uh, iron. Oh, you have enough iron? Wow. Yeah. Oh, you had iron right next to your city, didn't you? Uh, let's build this in three turns. And so, I need more wood again. A little bit fidgety. Sorry if that's coming through the microphone. That should work. So, 
I'm gonna spend some time just trying to get that cabbage field up. Hopefully that will uh, pay out at some point. Level two fight here. Uh, oh yeah, I see that. Well, I mean, three broken skeleton and one skeleton. Yeah, and of course he popped the skeleton out first. And you got six in your. Oh yeah, you got one extra guy. So you got nine now. I have six. Of course, you've had the cabbage pad up for a while. Only three or four turns. It actually was pretty good. I usually put them up, and then I don't get them, and then I complain, and then people laugh at me. <laughs> well, just getting one guy for me now would make a huge difference. I'm done following wolf trails, that's for sure. <laughs> Weren't they boar trails? Uh, wolf. I'm pretty sure it was wolf. Oh, I had a plan coming together and then it all fell apart. How's the fight going? Well, we're messing around with a lot of first actions and stuff like that, so it's going to be okay, I think. Do I confuse you or do I just shield you? Let's shield you. Because that can suck up a couple of hits. Yeah. And then I don't want you out here because you have no health, so let's go ahead and support. The support for one's a little better than anything else. We killed the skeleton though, which was the big thing. And we managed to shield all the damage in the round one. He's going to put his guy out, and we're going to poke him to death with all these pointy sticks. And we're going to hit end turn, and he's going to die. Okay, so we won our first level 2 encounter. <laughs> Good. Wasn't Ooh. that a level 2 before as well? It's just a rib cage. It looked good. The one where you went too far? That was also level 2? Um, where was it? You went too far, and then went... you had an encounter, and that was a level two as well. Oh, I didn't. I didn't actually run into it. I kind of walked past it. Oh no! Oh yeah! Right, right. No, they attacked me. You're right. You're right. Level two sneak challenge. Yay! Let's keep going. Oh, I like these. Ooh, I like my op options here. All right, let's counter offense. counter tactics so all right so we killed some stuff now we need to be able to tank six points let's tank with you we can tank three hits with you so one two three that's all their attacks good why don't you come out here so you'll kill this guy and now we need to do 13 to you yeah that's not gonna happen That'll just get closer. Not gonna have a very solid first round here, but it'll work. So when I do the non-combat, non-fight challenges, usually what I'm doing is I am doing a bunch of countering and then playing my guys at the end so that everybody's attacks go at the same people. Hmm. It was something that a viewer pointed out to me wants to do. And I didn't believe him, but I tried it, and it worked, and I said it wasn't a very good idea anyway, and then I kept using it. So then I changed my mind, and it must have been a good idea if I kept using it. You put everybody at, at one end, or...? Yeah, so that um, all their attacks, so then I have control of how many points I'm doing to each person, each of the bad guys. So... Um, Um, 
instead of having them split up in between where they might attack left or might attack right, I do it that way because it doesn't matter how many of them go down as long as you win. Um, and usually you have several people who have like zero attack or one attack, yeah. you know, and, and that you that you can wait, so you can just put them in front and tank with them. Yeah, I did. I did that as well when I played my first game. Yeah, it worked out good. So you wait, you wait for the AI to put all his guys out, and then you yep. first put all your zero damage guys to tank, and then you put your damage guys after that. Um, yeah, um, I try to arrange the damage guys so that I'll get kills as well. So that I know, you know, hey, this guy has nine points, so I want to do nine points, but then keep as many additional points as I can after that uh, for the next guy. So I can try and get as many kills as I possibly can. Mm. And it gets a little bit more tactical doing it, and sometimes it takes a little bit longer to fi figure it through, but it usually works out good. Ooh, the, finally got some good weapons. A 7-6 sword, that's pretty cool. New guy. Has a 4-5 sword. That's gotta be better than this, right? So I got two 4-5 swords. Milford's using a 2-5. Let's get him onto a 4-5 sword. Nope, it weighs too much. Does this one weigh too much? No, it doesn't. Okay, I got a shield here that is 3-4. 4-4. Don't have access for shields. One problem with having so many pointy stick is, sticks is I don't have a lot of defense. And having that defense can be really nice for the whole uh, shield um, ally uh, bonus. I would I would yeah. go with, with a varied weapon arrangement. So you yeah. have both pointy sticks and blunt yeah you know mix it up a little bit at this point I really don't want as much blunt as I used to I used to like to have like everybody with it but having like one or two just just to use on um, like you get a big group of spiders or rats or something just to try and knock out numbers hmm that's where that's where those really come in nice And stick around long enough to gather more than that. Wait, can I gather food? Oh, maybe not. I need one more turn to pass. One more turn. Yep. That'll be done with my cabbage field. <clears throat> Cabbage patch, whatever the name is. Something with cabbage in it. <laughs> <laughs> something, something cabbage. All right. And I need one more beacon to get my next research. The Knight of Kupala, let's prepare for the celebration. So there's a full story behind Kupala, Knight, and Thea, and I don't think we'll do that in a multiplayer game. <laughs> Let's get the celebrations underway. So, oh, I don't remember what these all are. Uh, I think, though, something gives me babies. Well, I mean, I know what gives me babies, but I think that one of these events gives me babies. No cheating. I'm not cheating, I'm just like reading them. We're going to go swimming in the lakes at night. The power of the gods protect you, yes. And we get fish and seaweed. Okay, last I knew. Last I knew. Um, fish and seaweed were not babies. Oh, I mean, we got incoming. Crazed bees. Oh, they couldn't have given us both of those at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Now we have to wait for this. 
<clears throat> but this, this should they should be easy, so let's see, we got no pointy yeah. sticks. Let's get the damage out. They'll all have pierce though. Yeah, I didn't get hit though. Uh, let's see, we got first action seven. Let's use that with somebody. Uh, yeah. So first get this one out. Ouch. That one had pierced. Uh, and then get this one out. Yeah, I see that. Now we need to first action this. There we go. And then shield ally. And some more shield ally. Oh, it's not my turn. <laughs> Sorry. Shield ally, and let's go. So, kill. Kill two. And kill one. There we go. One XP, one beacon. That should uh, give me a new research. Yes. And we got the cabbage field. That's nice. <clears throat> so, what do we want to research? You were saying... Weaker. A wicker, yeah, I usually do wicker because it makes good baskets. It used to make even better baskets, but it still makes good baskets. Do we have any wicker anywhere? Yes, right there. Nice. Well, also by researching it, you get five. Ah. So See, you got that's... five already. That's useful. Uh, crafting, basket. I'm gonna have to come up with an alternative though for gathering baskets because. Yeah, not getting not getting many materials for them. I might have to actually research towards spider silk. Ooh. That'd be awful. But I mean, it seems like it seems like there's a rebalance here for multiplayer. Maybe maybe part of that too is the fact that you've got two people doing it. I'm not sure what they're going for with it, but it could be that because you got two people doing it. Oh, there's spider silk out here. Well, there's ancient wood over by you. So unfair. Oh, wait, uh, is should I go one? and gather that? It's ancient no. wood. I only it's have two ancient. gatherers. I feel pretty limited on that. Yeah. Because I need those two in the town all the time to gather wood and food. Yeah. That's why I like the gatherer start. Because I have yeah. two gatherers for this city and then two to go with me. Uh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and Can ourselves craft food here. It doesn't matter. We'll take some fish with us. We'll take some seaweed with us, because who doesn't like eating seaweed? Yes, I know people really eat seaweed, but oh gosh, really? <laughs> well, on sushi, it's pretty good. Sushi! Yep. <laughs> Not a fan if you didn't notice. <laughs> well, um, I eat it just about anything, so... Yeah. Including sushi. Look, I try to like fish stuff. I've tried and tried. It just doesn't ever work. You mean you don't eat chicken? Uh, I mean, fillet fish in McDonald's? No. <laughs> you can't even taste the fish. Well, it's not even really real fish. It is real fish, it, yeah. I mean, we are talking McDonald's here, so. It's fish, all right. Uh, one more turn for the basket. Okay, well, I can do this. Right here, let's go. This way and this way. How about that? That could be a nice thing, maybe. 12 research points. I like 12 research points. Uh, uh, 
I really need those baskets. Yeah, me too. No, we got one. So I could really use the them. spider silk, but I don't have any. Gathers here. So I'll just come out here and search a little bit, see if I there can't uncover some more stuff. More wood. I got lots of cane if I wanted to research it, but it's kind of out of the way. See, I always have troubles. Um, I don't like to re spend time researching the stuff that's not top level, top tier um, things. Hmm. Uh, resource doesn't, doesn't work towards top tier resources. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, I know I shouldn't worry about it. I should just go ahead and do it sometimes. But if it's going to end at mid tier, then a lot of times it's like, eh, do I really want to do this? Let's get out on that expedition and see what we can find. Another spider's nest up here. Maybe I should go up there and check that stuff out because there's at least things out there. There's out here. Oh, there is this camp. Oh, there's that small hive that you can't see. <laughs> I see the small hive now because it just walked up there. Oh. But I'm going for the chest instead. Okay. By the way, who um, who got the basket? The one gathering food or the one gathering uh, the wood? Well, looks like food. <laughs> yeah, nine and five. Should probably be the other way around then. Level two spider's nest. All right, there we go. we're okay. Okay, so up here, let's check it out. Search, fight 40 formed bats and 3 hulking rats. Okay. Player's turn first. Let's bring this guy out. We got one confused that we can use if we want to, but I think I would rather get closer. I do like it. I do like confused. That is one of my more favorite options. Yeah, but these it's are not really always bats. it's not always it's not always the right situation. No, because this guy's got blunt and he can take out two bats instead of using you know, yep. he can take he can take out two bats yep. instead of confusing one, so get closer. Move in. And I can even first action, but do we want that? We don't need it, so it's better to just get closer. I don't even have string nearby. You've got a lot of string. Okay. Maybe at some point we should actually think about trading. I think we should be able to kill them. There we go, there we go, there we go, and. Yeah. Just about. Oh, there's one more. Okay. Uh, bring this guy out. Uh, we can just confuse the, the thing. We don't need to. Just play it. Bye bye. That's oh, a little bit of damage. Three to Lot Miller. That's a great name. Uh, we got lots of food out of that. And um, my guys will get. <clears throat> to the next level, next turn. Let's just come back this way. Da -da 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 -da. I think we should, if we get attacked here, we should probably make the last turn. Okay, I think we should make this the last turn then. All right, we're at that point. Let's just see what you got. Plus one gathering is <coughs> is good. I'm gonna do a sneak fight. All right, can I counter offense? I got a child. Two. Yes. Counter tactics nine, eight. Let's do eight. See what we get. Oh, Looks like he was level three. Why do I see the child though? In your inventory. 
There is none. <coughs> what? Oh yeah, there it is. <clears throat> it's better than nothing, at least. Um, How are we doing with the... Okay, so you can tank those two shots. Supplies. 12, 31. You'll be able to tank that without taking damage, and you'll be able to hit. So, second turn will kill you, we'll do a little bit of damage to you, and we'll have to call that good, because that's the best we're going to do in the first round. Unfortunately, we are tanking a few more shots, but, you know, we didn't take any damage since shielding solved all problems. Counter offense, good. I like when they have the first move and they play a pointy stick. They just put it right out there up front. So, thanks, guys. <laughs> oh, that's six oh no, I need meat for this. Really? Hmm. Okay, so change of plans. Excuse you. Put you out so that we get a kill. Got meat up there. I might not have thought that all the way through. Okay, well. But oh, I need well. a gabber then. I'm going to take five points of damage. Well, it's a sneak, but I'm going to take damage on a guy who, who is one of my few guys who actually can deal damage in this challenge. So, <laughs> not really the way you want to play it, but, you know, it's me. What do you expect? All right. So, five. Um, you're going to do five. Well, you tank it. It's two. Dead. You come out. You come out. And we should be good. Just three turns of food. That's not good enough. We need this as well. Six turns. Hmm. Give me some of that. Eight turns and some wood. All for two enchanted bones, huh? Great expedition, and then go back into the town and change Restraint. gathering to food, I think. Screen, strain. If I do, I won't be able to get the mushrooms. I need to get out one more tile. That's going to be in the next episode, though. There we go. I think I'm at the end of mine, too. And in between, I can double check if I needed to craft anything. So, hit end turn and see if we're ending it. Oh, I just got an encounter. Let's see. Okay. Uh, Sky's Docking, Souls of the Dead, Be on Guard, or offer us a prayer to Velas, the Master of the Afterlife. I only got one person in the town, mind you. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody else is out. <laughs> Pray to uh, your deity. <laughs> what in doubt? <laughs> But then you know how things go when you listen to me. So. Okay, what's the cosmic tree? So that's on the map. Yeah. No, it was divine quest. Sorry, it's right next to you. Oh. And on that note, it's time to sign off. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying. We'll yeah. see you next time. See you guys next time. Bye. -bye. Take care.